Let's have a look at the use of an ankle pick grip, um, which can be very useful from half guard in general. It can be very useful for creating kazushi, for creating sweeps. We'll look at that throughout this video. Um, it's also very useful for entering into variations of leg locks. Uh, let's look first at basic ankle picking. If someone is standing in front of you, typically an ankle pick refers to a situation where I catch my training partner just there. It can also be an inside ankle pick, but for now we'll look at the outside ankle pick where I grab at the Achilles tendon and typically my intention is to pull forward and sweep them out of balance while I'm holding another part of their body or the mat. Okay. Um, it also occurs in half guard situations, but it'll be different because typically your opponent has changed their position down to their knees. Why would they do that? Well, if they're here in front of us and we catch our training partner here at the heel, they're often worried about the threat of Ashigurami entries. Okay. When they feel the danger of leg longs, they'll often put a knee down on the floor and then they'll put their second knee down and you'll find yourself holding that same grip. Just like so. And from there, there's many ways for you to go on the attack. Okay. It can also occur while their knees are on the mat themselves. So if I have a basic half guard situation, I can just sneak my hand through and catch my training partner right there at the heel. Okay. So regardless of whether it started standing or started with him on his knees, we end up in the same situation. Okay, so once again, if someone's standing over us, and from here they put a knee down, and then from here they put their other knee down, you're right there in the same grip. Or if you started down in a more conventional half guard situation, you might just sneak your hand through and catch them right there at the heel. Just like so. Turn around. So you get that catch. Okay. That's the grip you're going to work with. Interestingly, if your opponent goes to sprawl his leg back, you're going to find it's exceptionally difficult because you're controlling the very end of the lever. Okay? It's a very, very, it doesn't look like much, but it's a shockingly strong grip when you work in these positions. And we'll see that it has great utility when it comes time to enter into leg locking scenarios.